You know what, if you're just waking up this morning, kind of one eye open going, oh, we're crawling to the end of the day, it's Friday, finally I've got two words for you. Free pancakes, brunches too in White Knoll. Stay with us, we're coming back. It is a food Friday, stay right here. All right, guys, it is a food Friday. Free pancakes until 9 o'clock where? Okay, brunches. brunches. There you go, right there. It says right here. Here are the brunches. Actually, brunches too, as a matter of fact, up here in South Lake Drive uh, in Red Bank, White No, whatever you're going to call it these days, Lexington, right? Lexington. This is Jane. You're going to be here all morning long at brunches too. Again, free pancakes. Come by and see us during the broadcast. All right, let's get cooking. It is a food Friday, right? Yes, sir. What is. are we making, Jamie? Oh, uh, let's make the ultimate omelet. The ultimate omelet. I love it. Hit me off. How, what do we do here? How do we all start? Right. Well, first of all, we start here. We put onions and green peppers in it. I like that. I like that. Some mm -hmm. tomatoes and ham. I love it. I love it. All right. All right. Some bacon and sausage. No sausage. Can no I get rid of the sausage? How about yes, that? Yes, sir, we can. How about we yes, double sir. up with the bacon? Double, double the bacon. bacon. Oh, Why not? Right of course, don't forget, guys, our uh, Food Friday is brought to you by the Chef Store and U.S. Foods as well. All right, so you're going to put on some, is that just water? What is yes, that, sir, we steam it and make it nice, okay. it nice and steamed up for you. So this is kind of like a Western omelet with a kick then. Yes, sir, it is. A little bit extra. Oh, this is really awesome. How many of these do you think you make in an average shift? Oh, uh, I can't tell you. I lose count. A bunch. <laughs> a bunch. All right. How many eggs go into that, Jamie? Well, we put three omelets in there. Three eggs in three the omelet. Three eggs in the omelet. Three. You count them? One, two, and three. Again, three pancakes. Just throwing that out there. I'm really excited about this. So what is the secret? Because at home when I try to make an omelet, it never comes out right. It's always soupy and it breaks, but you can make it like a pro. So what is the secret? Oh, the secret is you got to be a good cook. <laughs> <laughs> well, see, that's my first mistake right there. Did you know what just happened? All right. I see how it's going to roll. Then it's going to be a long morning at brunches, too. Here. <laughs> no, that's for sure. See, you're doing it thin then. Yes, sir. And you spread it around the grill oh, real nice and smooth. See, that's how you do it. All right. And it doesn't take long to cook that way either, does it? No, sir, it doesn't. Just like that, that looks really, really good. You can let you really take a shot at it the chance if you want. What do you want me to do? We've got to just spread it. going to just kind of pet it a little bit? Yeah. All right. Where do I put Pick this up. in? Well, let's, you want to throw some cheese in here? Or? Yeah, yes, I do. Where's All that cheese right. at? The cheese is right, right there. there. Oh. Put some extra in there. There we go. Okay. All right, we're going to let that melt in there. Let it melt down in there a little bit, and then we'll pick all the veggies and meat up. And, and throw them in just like that. Oh, that yes, looks sir. that looks really good. That's when it gets done, it looks like that. Man, that is a that is a big omelet, brother. Yes, sir. Okay, let's go ahead and plate that baby up. We're going to let this one cook. We're going to try this because, you know, after all, we are at a restaurant, right? Yes, sir. All right. Anybody got a fork anywhere? I did not prepare with a fork. That's all right. It looks good. I'm going to trust him. I'm going to try it in a couple of minutes. This is the ultimate omelet. Oh, there it is all together. We're going to put details for you at watch.com slash food Fridays. We're going to be at brunches too all morning long here cooking, having fun. And again, free pancakes right now. Stop in and say, hey, I want Tyler's for pancakes. And if you get lucky, I won't make them myself. Oh, here's the fork. Stay with us, guys. We're coming back live and local from brunches too here at Red Bank on South Lake Drive. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Mm -hmm. That's ultimate. Oh, yeah. Brunches too, baby. Can we get them free pancakes? What if I disbanded? Then I would just walk away. <laughs> she just walked away. Did you hear that? Guys, it is a food Friday here live and local at Brunches 2 at Red Bank up on South Lake Boulevard. Of course, our, our food Friday segment is brought to you by the Chef Store up on St. Andrews Road. And of course, U.S. Foods, Miss Tiffany Metz. And we've been making the, we made the ultimate omelet a few minutes ago. And now it is time, because it's never the wrong time, for a blue cheese burger. Bacon burger. Bacon too. Blue cheese bacon burger at brunches. Let's do this. Okay. Right, so right. how do we start? Okay. First of all, here is a six ounce hamburger meat. Okay. So you guys actually pat all your own meat here. You don't we just do. buy the um, the little discs already done. All right. We do. All right. So how do you, what's, what's the proper way to pat that out? Just put, put some weight behind it. There you go. I want mine good and thin. There. Mm. Love it. So six ounces of meat. That's a good place to start. Hey guys, don't forget, brunch is two. That means there's another one. Go and throw it on there if you want okay. to. That means there's another one on Leaf Park Road as well. So you can check out brunches, the original brunches, out on uh, Leaf Park Road as well. All right, so we'll throw that on. Excellent. Nice work. How long do you cook a good burger for? And is that thin? Um, oh, we're going to char-broil yeah, it. Okay, here we go. We're going to char-broil it. All right. 
Um, it just depends. I mean, you can get it cooked medium, medium well, or well done. So just like that? It just depends. What's your favorite way? Well done. Like, just, oh, just well done all the way? Yeah. All right, so we're going to go ahead and char that up normally. Yeah, we throw some blue cheese on it, right? Yeah. And we we're going to prepare this one for you. I'm going to look at me being the right. chef all of a sudden, right? All right, where do we go with this? Bring it over here. Huh? Bring it over here. Here's the bun that we already toasted on okay, the grill. Okay, that makes it easy. Guys, you can do this at home as well. If you go to watch.com slash food Fridays, we put recipes for you and the easy stuff and some of the secrets, too, we get here at brunches. All right, what do I want on here? Do you Anything want it loaded? I want it loaded. On it? I want, let's see, I want some mayonnaise. Okay. Mayonnaise. I'll throw some mayonnaise on it like that. Yeah, okay. I ain't gonna be making out with nobody today, so we'll go ahead and throw some onions on, all right? Okay. There's some lettuce. lettuce. Keep it healthy on a Friday morning. Yep. There's some pickles, oh, yeah. tomatoes. Mm, yeah, all right. I have tomatoes. Ooh, more of this. There we go. All righty, there's that. Um, we're gonna get myself a pickle. Hang on, hang on. <laughs> I thought there was bacon on this thing. There is. Where's Put the bacon? Put it on last. Okay. Oh, this is good stuff, guys. Mm -mm -mm. Watch.com slash Food Fridays. Brunches too. Oh, don't forget free pancakes right now at Brunches too. Come up here to uh, to Red Bank, to White. No, what do you want to call it? And you know what? I'm going to throw a couple of these on top. <laughs> there you go. Just like that. Free pancakes right now, guys. This morning during our Food Friday broadcast. Thank you to the whole team up here at Brunches too. Broken us up the food. You're getting hooked up too. Free pancakes this morning. Come up, join us. I love that. Stay with us. We are live and local here at Brunches 2. I'm right back. Order up. Food Friday right here, Brunches 2 on uh, South Bay Boulevard. You know, Red Bank, I know, right up here hanging out with uh, with Stacy. And of course, you never know who you're going to see. Our segment every Friday brought to you by U.S. Food Chef Store. Shane from the Chef Store, he's walked in to sit down. You never know who you're going to see at Brunches 2. No. Even this guy, Jamie, we are cooking this morning. Oh, before I forget, free pancakes right here in the store for our broadcast. We're done in about an hour and a half. So get up here, free breakfast. Come see us, free pancakes. So we're working on our Western omelet, the classic Western. What is the Brunches classic Western? Uh, that is the green peppers. All right. And you got some onions. All right. And some ham. There you go. Nothing wrong with that. And this mm -hmm. is a two egg omelet right here. This one's a two egg. The other one's a three egg. So yes. it depends on how hungry you are, right? It depends on how you can get it. Four eggs, five eggs, how many eggs you would give, like. Give me, give me a dozen egg omelet, please. <laughs> we'll make it happen. Ooh, dog, I feel like Rocky <laughs> in the top of Philadelphia. Just shaking my hands after that. That was that just a little oil up there? Yes, sir. A little bit of oil up there. All right. The same thing, you're going to spread that up. We learned that a few minutes ago. The trick to the omelet that I can never figure out is right there. Spread it like that. Well, I don't have a big cooking oven like this or a cooktop, but I may go buy one just so I can make a good omelet every Sunday morning is what I'm thinking before I head on it to church. All right, you're going to cook that down. Guys, oh, that smells so good. I love I love the smell of a Western omelet. It smells so darn good, doesn't it? Oh, yes, it does. I love it. I love it. This one right here is actually going to be from Mr. Barfield because that's my boss. All right, the boss. You can hear his mouth running in the background, can't oh, you? Yes, there you can. go. Will you go ahead and wrap that one up there? <laughs> that's a true story. You guys, come up and check out Brunches. Of course, uh, this store has been open for just about a year or so. October of last year, it opened up the uh, original Brunches down on Lee Park Road in West Columbia. You can check out that place, too. But great food, good stuff here on a Food Friday. Go to foodfriday.com slash food Friday. I'm sorry, go to watch.com slash Food Fridays because foodfriday.com slash Food Friday would be kind of silly. It'd be a picture of Jamie going, hello, ladies. Hey, right? ladies. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to be here live all day long. Tomorrow morning, long. come get free pancakes. And brunch is two right here on Southern Boulevard. Come up, get them, and uh, the pancakes be yours. Maybe I won't even make them. Well, Friday, it is a Food Friday brought to you by U.S. Food Chef Store. Very excited today. We're up in Red Bank. Well, I know right on uh, South Lake Drive at Brunches 2, not Brunches 1, the original down on Lee Park Road. Brunches 2. Make some breakfast, had some burgers. Got some ribeye steak coming up, too. Yes, it's a breakfast show. Well, not really a regular steak. Also, don't forget free pancakes right now until 9 o'clock. You come to Brunches 2, walk in and go out. My free flapjacks that I will make for you come right now. They are free, free, and that's good for me. Tiffany, free for me. Pancakes, how do we make them better? Okay, start off with, we have 18, I mean, I'm sorry, 16 eggs in here. Those are 16 eggs? 16 eggs. Wow. All right, I'd be, if I turned that thing up and sucked it back, I'd be as big as Rocky, right? True. Okay, there you go. All right, let me get that out of the way. All right, the there you go. Add a gallon of milk. A whole gallon? A whole gallon. Ooh, this is good for you, kids. This is actually good for you, then. A whole gallon of milk. Is this like your mama's recipe? Is this like the, the Tiffany Tiffany mama recipe? My mom's recipe wasn't this good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Man, this milk just keeps on coming, doesn't it? Oh, my goodness gracious. All right. Guys, we're going to put the recipe for you also at watch.com slash food Fridays. I've asked every chef in America the same question. Why does vanilla not taste as good as it smells? Because it smells amazing. Four, five, six. Would this be a dollop, a pinch? Sorry, what? I was how counting. Much? What I know, how much? 
<laughs> yes, there it is. All right. Is that is that a pinch or a dollop of, of uh, vinegar? Uh, I count to six. Ahead. Okay. And which is? And then butter. Liquid oh, butter. Good count. gracious, Paula Dean. Seriously? Ca count to three. <laughs> this, you have a couple of these uh, pancakes here or brunches too, and they have to run seven or eight miles, clearly. All right. Mix now it what? up. Next, All right. Next thing is flour. All right, the flour. <laughs> oh, my. How many how many um, batches of this do you make like in an average day, Tiffany, here at Brunch's uh, too? I mean, we pretty much make a batch a day. Whew. You go through so, a lot? But keep adding right. flour, keep adding flour. Just like that and mix it up? And then I can't tell you the rest, because if I tell you the rest, then have I'd have kill to me. kill you. I understand. My well, let's get over here and show how it's made there. So we're going right. to continue that in a second. Let's head over here to the flat iron. Here we go. All right. So we've got some made here. Okay. Okay. How much you put in? What's the perfect amount here to dollop in? Because every Sunday morning, I'm making breakfast for me and my two dogs, and I can never do it right. All right. One scoop. Right. Oh, just like that. Beat mm -hmm. it a couple mm -hmm. times. Yeah. And there you go. <laughs> you just got to hit it around a little bit. Just All right. All right. Little Are these babies be ready to flip? Oh, look at that. Here we go. Look at that, guys. These are the flapjacks, and two of these could be yours for free right now. It brunches to up here on South Lake Drive in uh, Red Bank. Wait, oh, I broke that one. You don't have to have Oh, man, look what I just did. That's all right. These are going to be free here. Stop in and say, I want to make my pancakes, and they are free for you right now on a Food Friday. I am I am not cut out for this job. Stay with us. We're coming back. Look what I just did. That is not pretty. That's really bad, actually. It's okay. You can eat that. Oh, good gracious. Friday right here at Brunch's 2, Suffolk Drive in Red Bank. If I went on high school, we're going to set on that. Home of these free pancakes till 9 o'clock today. you got 45 minutes. Jump in your car, come here. Ollie's making pancakes, but they're free right now for you till 9 o'clock here at Brunch's. That's a fun thing on a food Friday. All right, Jimmy, you ready? What are we making here? Ribeye steak for breakfast? Yes, sir. Why not, right? Yeah. All right, what is the secret to a good ribeye steak here at Brunch's 2? We marinate them ourselves. Right. And put our own special seasonings on it. Okay. And once it comes off this flour, does this charboil, it's right. good to go and melt in your mouth. So this is what we've had here on the flat top for a little bit. So you charboil it first, right? How do you prepare that? How do you prepare it? This man is multi-talented, by the way. He's talking to me, he's flipping burgers at the same time. That is a nice piece of beef, too. Yes, wow. So that just marinated. 14, 14 ounces. Good gracious. All right, so you're going to put that in. You're going to go ahead and charbroil that a little bit, and you throw it on the flat top. We've been cooking this one for just a little bit, right? Yes, sir. This one right here is getting ready to go on so out. So how do you know when I say I want it medium well? How do you know that it's medium well? Well, I know the feel, Lord. You know the feel? It tightens up as you cook. Is that that old trick here? You, you kind of put yes, right sir. here and you put your hand right here, and you feel that? On up. Just like <laughs> that. Like all right, you know, that one looks that one looks good to me. That one's good to me. So, all right, hold on now. Let me grab a, grab a plate here. Pull that down. Hey, let me grab a plate. All right, there we go. Put that on. And Perfect. There you go. All right. Here we drop some fries too. We'll put some more down here. Come on here. Get some of these. Uh, these. Are these done yet? These are probably done, right? Yes, sir. It is doing. Close enough, right? Okay. Here we go. Down here. Like that. Almost. Oh, 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 oh. There it is. I love it. Done. Am I looking good? Am I ready to work here, brunches? And then slide that over like that. A ribeye. A ribeye. Close enough for me, right? You gotta put a little bit of seasoning on your wing chips. Oh, look at that. Perfect. That's, that is a plate full of food right here. Brunches, too. We're gonna put recipes and details for you. Watch.com slash food Fridays. Thank you to U.S. Food Chef Store for having us out here all the time. We're gonna wrap it up here. Nice little fun. It's a little bit. Don't forget, 45 minutes left for you to get free pancakes right here at Brunches, too. Come see us. I'll make them myself. Stay right here. We're live and local. All right, Dana. Well, thank you very much. You know, it's a day to be inside having breakfast here at Brunches 2. We've been here on this Food Friday. I'm Royal on Stacey, the owner of Brunches 2 and Brunches 2-2. Two -two. Right, the original Brunches, then Brunches 2. Correct. There you go. So you guys have been around a long while. I know Brunches has been a name for a long time in the community, but you've got Brunches, the original Brunches on Lee Park Road. You opened, what, three or four years ago? Yeah, that, mm -hmm. I've been okay. in about 10 years now. Good gracious. Yep. Really good food there on Lee Park Road, by the way. So last October, coming up on a year, you opened Brunches 2 up here in uh, in Red Bank on, uh, on right. South, South Boulevard. Right. Right. South Lake Drive, I guess it is. Right. right. Uh -huh. yeah. How's it been up here? It's been great. So far, so good. I want to thank the community for helping us out. Sure. It's been real, uh, real um, perspective up here, so we have been doing bad. We've been up here about three hours or so making breakfast, having some fun and stuff, but everybody comes in. It's, just, it's really happy to be here. You know everybody. Their staff knows everybody, and that says something for the restaurant this family as well. Family. I like that a lot. Now, now, listen, we did make this rebbe here, and we did make an omelet, but what is all this? Because there's extra food I did not make. I want to know what it is. We got uh, chicken and waffle here. It's new 
new thing we came out with. Of course you do. It's a boneless, skinless uh, piece of chicken. Yeah. Oh, but see, I like the boneless, skinless because sometimes I come out on a bone. I'm not a bone on a chicken eater. Right. But that's, I can just pick that up and just eat it like oh, that. All right, the blue good. cheese burger here with fries. Hang on, we did try that. Uh -huh. Yep, uh -huh. yep. Mm -hmm. Of course, you got your chef salad for right. the lighter years. <laughs> oh, that should be me. It's not. Going got on. Homemade uh, onion rings. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Got bang bang shrimp. Bang, you have bang, uh, shrimp. mushroom appetizer. Oh, very nice. And of course, your uh, breakfast, it's eggs, your standard bacon, and grits. Breakfast from this Champions. This is my favorite right here. 16 ounce ribeye. Is that what you eat for breakfast on a Friday morning? Oh, usually? yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> All right. Brunches, too. You guys are open. Uh, you start open at 6. At six. How late do you open every day? Uh, here, uh, it's Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday until 3. Okay. And we're open Thursday night, Friday night, Saturday night here. We also um, um, feature beer and wine. Okay, so you can come in like a happy hour, like, yep. any, like on a Friday afternoon. Yep. You come up for a happy hour as well, right, not just for. Right. I guess you're going to bacon eggs and a. And, and, and a, and a yeah. cold one, I guess. Cold beer, yes, sir. There Absolutely. you go. So yep. you got all that stuff going on. It's a great atmosphere. I love it up here. Just up um, right on South Lake across from right, Walmart. Right. You cannot miss it. This has been great. Thank you to your staff, of course. I miss Tiffany back there, Jamie back there, putting up with me, wrecking all the um, the, the pancakes it's all so morning good. long. Don't, don't forget about the Little Lee Park Road with my new manager, Greg Cole. That's right, Greg. Oh, running the shop. I was actually, I had breakfast there about yep. two weeks ago with my dad. He runs the show now. There you go, Greg. Nice job on that. So, man, I really appreciate it. It's been a whole a lot of fun this Thanks morning. A lot, brother. whole lot of food to come back. Yes, friendy, Dana, yes, we'll bring you some food back. Maybe the ribeye. Well, the ribeye's probably not going to make it, but it is a Food Friday. Log on to watch.com slash Food Friday, and they can ship recipes and all the fun right here at, um, at brunches, too. Guys, back to you. Mm, I got some meat to do now.